Hi, this is Mike DiMatteo with Mike's Gig. We're here at the NAM 2022, and this is uh, post-pandemic, and maybe pandemic starting again. So I'm talking with Derek from Vanguard Audio, yep. and we're gonna talk about his microphones. Uh, how long has Vanguard been in business? So we started in 2013, there was three years of design work, and then we launched our first mic in 2016. And why Vanguard microphones? Why, why is that in the market? What, what is the, your hallmark? Yeah, so um, there's, a, there's a bit of background there. Uh, the first thing is that uh, we don't sound like anybody else. We're original microphones. We're not trying to be the next slightly cheaper U47 or whatever. We're just trying to sound like us, sound like tools that we use in our own studio and that we're proud to call microphones that we've used on our own songs, on our own projects. So we're not trying to sound like anybody else. We do original designs. We're trying to build new mouse traps or build better versions of, of older mouse traps and make improvements on them. The second thing is, um, like I said, we're trying to be a professional tools. They go through a lot of testing and listening on real world studio sessions before they go out into the world. But we probably did a several dozen variations of the V13 before we were finally satisfied with it and released it. Um, so uh, there's professional, there's original, and lastly is affordable. I, w I was an audio student, I was a music student, and I had the choice between a $99 mic I could beat to death with a stick in the mix, or a $5,000 mic that I couldn't afford without selling a kidney, and quite frankly, I was uh, in college in America, I wasn't enough debt, you know, so I decided to go with the cheap mic, and it was very frustrating for me. So my goal is to keep uh, these tools as, a, as affordable as possible so that people can make music without making a ton of credit card payments too. And are your microphones uh, dynamic, condenser, or both? We make condenser microphones only right now, but we have, uh, let's just say we have a lot of plans. We have a lot of good ideas. And do you have uh, dedicated power supplies as well? Yeah, so we have a tube mic that has a dedicated power supply, as tube mics often need. Um, and then we also make a, uh, a FET transformerless mic called the V4, which is also uh, a mono, it uses the same capsule. We have a stereo mic, the V44S, that's just two V4s. And then we also have a FET transformer small diaphragm condenser that has a large diaphragm attachment as well. And where are you headquartered? We're actually headquartered just up the road in Montclair, California. 